What's going on everybody, Battlefield No Scope here, and welcome back to some more World Conquer 3. So, thought I'd go ahead and pump out another episode. It's been a day since I've played, so we'll sort of catch up here, go ahead and end the turn, get some cash flowing in so we can buy uh, troops. <clears throat> so yeah, it's been a day since i played, we'll catch up here, see what I've missed. I believe last episode we started our uh, invasion of North Korea. To draw the Chinese out of China to come and protect North Korea, or, well, Korea itself. And we were also, we started our invasion of Alaska. Destroyed that. Okay, and our carrier apparently took a lot of damage. Did not even realize that. Oh, well, that carrier's gonna be lost anyway. Get a destroyer. Assault infantry. Yep, as I thought, they built... They've built troops in Peking. And they've captured Peking. The Russians have decided to move down. They hopefully will not take. No, they won't be able to take Chungchung. We'll have to build troops there. Peking has fallen. We'll have to retake it. I think we're going to push for Mongolia. That is our best bet because they have really been hitting us hard <clears throat> and supporting the Chinese. Let's see, where can we... There we go. Uh, North Korean capital is now ours for the taking. And, uh, let's go ahead and get, we're going to start building up a lot more troops. We'll need them to assault. Probably going to bring them over into North Korea and then into China, I think, is what we're, our, my plan is. And we do, I mean, we have, oh yeah, we have troops over here. <coughs> Re- Capturing the Philippines, so I think what we can do, we'll deploy. Destroyed them. We can take troops from the Philippines, push into Taipei, and then into China, come in behind them, while other troops push in from Korea. I think will be a good idea. Open the Netherlands, been defeated by Germany.
push out of there. Damage them. Taipei is now ours. We'll continue to send troop reinforcements over to reinforce them because we, we, we could lose Taipei very quickly. fleet, two carriers. Still continuing, there we go, the Australians got decided to push up out for some reason. Leave that artillery gun there. We'll build up our sort of fleet in the Philippine Sea. This fleet over here is sort of dying. I haven't even been paying attention over here. I forgot about the Russians. Hmm, that's going to be a problem. The Russians coming at us from one side and the Chinese from the other. out of Korea. Reinforcements from Japan and the Philippines will be sent over into China so we can hold. China is starting to get very powerful, which they can be once they start gaining the upper hand. <clears throat> the U.S. and uh, Canada or Russia, they haven't really done anything. Of course, they're focused on fighting Germany and Europe at the moment. Continuing to hold. Midway looks like it could be open for attack. We can move the fleet there and attack it. Meanwhile, the other U.S. fleet, our fleet over there, is getting pretty weak. <clears throat> looks like Can yeah, Canada sent most of their forces to England to support them while they're fighting Germany. The U.S. doesn't have many forces in the Pacific left. They're pretty stretched. We only have two carriers. Um,
Uh, well, oh well. That assault infantry will have to do. Reinforcements from Japan are going over. Uh, we're continuing to build up our fleet in the Philippine Sea. The This defensive fleet with this carrier is not going to last much longer. But I think next episode we'll go for Midway. Alright guys, we're going to end the episode here. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe for more. Uh, it helps out my channel. Uh, please subscribe. really will help. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.